Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. So not sure if you guys have heard about these two vile, pathetic losers, but they were both arrested. So the second one was arrested also. So they were arrested for attacking a seven-year-old boy for wearing a Trump hat. So him and his mom was outside of the DNC convention where they were attacked. And I'm going to show you guys the video. But this is so common. So you hear so much about Trump supporters being attacked for what they're wearing, for having a lawn sign in their front yard, for all kinds of reasons, you know? You never hear about Trump supporters attacking Biden supporters. It, it just doesn't happen. And they also didn't even attack Obama supporters. It just didn't happen. But if you're a Trump supporter, they think somehow they have a right to attack you. Well, wrong. Um, you guys should watch the news because you all are getting arrested by the hundreds. So it's not up to you who we vote for. It's not up to you what we wear, who we support. It's not up to you what political party sign we have in our front yard. It's just plain and simple, not your business. So apparently anyone who doesn't agree with you is wrong. That's not how it is in America. It never has been. And unfortunately for you, it never will be. We can support whatever party we want. We can wear whatever we want. We can do whatever we want, the same as you. It's a free country. And I'm actually thinking the more that I see, the more that I watch the news, I really don't think America is the right country for Democrats lately. You guys, if you don't like it here, it is a free country. It's free for you to be here and it's free for you to leave. So this might not be the right country for you after all. You should, you know, think about think about leaving because you're not going to change it. You're not going to change it into what, into what you want to change it into. So attacking people for their political beliefs is just going to get you arrested like these two pathetic, vile losers. Let's take a look at the video. Can you get off my property? Get off my property? Are you destroying my property? Yes, we are. You know that's a I felony? See that one too. We don't get that one. Get away from me. Get the out. Get it, Liv. Get it. Touch my hat. Take your hat. That's somebody else's hat. Take that one back. Get, get your hat back, baby. Look at what you just did to my son. Get your hat back, baby. Get your hat back, baby. Give me back my hat. 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 I'm telling you right now. You're you're gonna just you're gonna steal my property? I'll follow you to your car and get your license plate. I'm walking. I live in town. Call 911. You want me to call 911? You want me to call 911? Taylor! Taylor! These people right here are taking your hat. They attacked my son. I have it on video. I have it on video. Your kid back up. I have it on video. I have it on video. I have it on video. I'm telling you to back the Yeah, you wanna try me? You wanna try me? You wanna try me? I got the whole thing on video. I got the whole thing on video. Don't attack. Oh, you gonna punch him? You gonna punch him? Oh yeah, you wanna punch him? Oh, you wanna sucker punch me? You wanna sucker punch me? Take my hat. Take my hat, baby. You want to sucker punch me? Nobody punch me. Yeah, I saw you punch, punch me. No, I saw you trying to punch me. Take you over. Go ahead. I wish you would. We will knock you out. We will knock you. That's why when you went to hit me, you did it, right? That's why when you went to hit me. I'm not trying to hit you. I'm not trying to fight you. You're coming after me. I'm not afraid of you. I'm not afraid. Okay, so you guys saw the video. What is someone supposed to do in this situation? So don't forget, no matter what the media is telling you, this is still America, and you still do have a right to vote for whoever you want to. You can wear your Trump hat. You can wear your Biden shirt. You can wear whatever you want to out in public. So what are you supposed to do? The media is telling you that it is okay to attack people who are Trump supporters. That is what the media is telling you. And the police are telling you different because these two losers have been arrested. So if you believe 
that this mother and son should have been attacked because they were Trump supporters, then America is changing into something that's no longer going to be recognizable, and there's going to come a time where you believe something and you support something that a lot of other people don't, and you're going to be attacked, and that's going to be okay. But as of right now, that's not how America works. And if you don't like it, and you don't like America, then maybe you shouldn't be here.